Hello leaders, welcome back to Christmas Tub. I am so excited. Are you excited? Welcome, welcome back. Now, we are still learning how to be a leader. Last term, we learned about habit one. And habit one says, be proactive. What did we learn about habit one? How can we be proactive? We learned to take initiative, we learned how to be responsible. We learned how to stop and think. We also learned about our circle of control and our circle of no control. And also we learned about choosing our weather. That was so much fun. Now, this term, we are going to learn about habit two. Let us listen to teacher Mariam as she talks about habit two. Hello leaders, welcome back from your holiday. Hope you enjoyed. Yes, as Miss Leticia said, we are going to learn the second habit. And what does it say? It says, begin with the end in mind. Say it with me. Begin, meaning you start, with the end. Think of that thing that you want to happen. You point ahead in mind. Think. And what does it mean? You have to have a plan. There are steps to follow in order to learn how to begin with the end in mind. And today, we are going to look at the first step. And it says, what matters most? Say it with me. What matters most? And what does it mean? It means you choose what is very important to you, that is very big, and what is good for you. We are going to see how little Sharon chooses what matters most to her. Hello, Sharon. Hello, Mommy. How are you? I'm fine. Tomorrow I'm taking you to Judge's place. Yeah, I'm going to Judge's. I need to fuck. I need to fuck. Oh, let me pack in my dinosaurs. Nice. 
nyam nyam nyam. Eating healthy is very important to me. And now that I know the things that are important to me, I can begin with the end in mind. Yay! Will you begin with the end in mind at home?